Hi guys, it's me, Dude. And Dad. Nice to do. We're going to be reviewing the Air Characters Light and Inflatable Easter Easter Express train over 5 feet tall and almost 15 feet long. Right. <laughs> review. From Inflatable Greetings Air Characters. I don't know if this company's still in business anymore. I, I've tried to find a date on this, but I can't. I want to say we've had this thing definitely over 10 years. Uh, Boog was even born before uh, I purchased it. Uh, it was either right after he was born or right before. Uh, but it's very old. But this is one of the first companies that ever came out to try to compete with Jimmy well, way back when. Well, 10 years ago. They would have came out in 2014. Yeah, yeah. So somewhere in there. But for some reason, my gut tells me it's even older than that. We're not 100% sure. But this is the box. It is a little beat up. Um, I haven't used this thing in a very, very long time. It's kind of been in storage. I thought this year, hey, we would get it out, try to do some Easter inflatables. So, um... But yeah, you can see here the box and the back. This is your instructions. Uh, this company was very nice to give you step-by-step -step instructions. So you have one through six, all the things you need to do. No description of how to do them, just to show you how to do them. Right, and this is one of the first ones I can remember too that actually came with a separate blower. Uh, so it kind of had the separate blower through the tube thing. Of course, that died many years ago, so I'm using a replacement blower for it now. But here it is. Luke, if you want to stand up there next to it, uh, it is very large. Uh, the 15 foot long thing is not an exaggeration. It is pretty huge. Yeah, and I would say probably Boog is 5'8. Kind of consider it is on a little bit of a hill here. So it is definitely over 5 foot tall, I would say. Close to 6 foot tall, probably, uh, at the top of the train there. So I'm going to start here in the beginning. And we have the bunny at the very front of very the engine is the Easter Express. Dun, dun, dun. And you can see ours is still very, very wrinkly because he just came out of the box after many, many years of being in storage. But I think uh, in a day or two, he would look a lot better than this. Uh, yes. Um, like I said, very bright and colorful. There is the bunny conductor. Oh yes, like the colors. There he is. Kind of a till top to the engine. Now we have our first caboose here. You can see the tube connecting all together. And there's our eggs um, in the first car. We're having a bit of, this is actually from, I think from the lights. We're kind of pulling this part down. We can kind of pull that out some. This one I think is having the same problem. But, yeah, as you can see, got two eggs here in the middle cart. Another tube section. And the final cart, the caboose. Got a couple of cute ducks, like a boy and a girl. And a lot of them looks like they have a, 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 kind of a rare case of white dot osis. Yes. Uh, <laughs> this one here looks on the left, looks like it is, she is absolutely scared to death. <laughs> and, and the other one has white dot osis over there. Right, right, <laughs> yes. But um, overall, like I said, a, a really cool inflatable, I think. I've always enjoyed it, even though I haven't used it in quite a long time. The thing I don't enjoy about it is, again, and this one uh, did not come with the uh, strap downs on the bottom, you know, for you to put the stakes through and actually sink it down. So the only option you have is to use the tethers, um, which is kind of a pain for the full out. They're not always necessary unless you just live in a really windy place, which we don't. So I don't usually use those, but no choice on this one. And you can see the back side here. And this is what makes it down. Pull that going there. Actually seems to look a little faded on the back. The front looks a little faded on the back. It's kind of unusual, but may have just been the way it was sitting in the box or something. But here he is. He has made his way back out for Easter 2024. So, <laughs> yeah. So anyhow, like I said, just wanted to give you guys a look at that, see what you thought. A little blast in the past, something interesting you don't see every day. The old 15-foot inflatable train from Air Characters. Inflatable greetings. Yes. All right, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a happy Easter, and we'll see you on the next one. Nice to go, everybody. Happy Easter.